Number five. Number four. Number three. Number two. Number one.
right, guys, so that's my list there. And as you see, that Pac-Man game, pa Miss Pac-Man, the Pac-Man collection game, was number one on the list. And the main reason that that's number one is I'm a Pac-Man fanatic. And I know a real Pac-Man ROM from one that's not a real Pac-Man ROM. The one that's being ran on the Coleco, original Coleco system, is the original Pac-Man ROM. Yes, that is the actual ROM. All the patterns that I was using is the same ones that I use on my main machine downstairs. So these homebrew games, these will run on a stock ColecoVision from 1982. No changes, no expansion modules, nothing like that. It will run on the system by itself. And that's what makes these games to me so amazing because like the number one on this list, if it would have came out um, back in like 82, 83, 84, it would have been a game changer. Now, also, I wanted to point this out too, guys. So these are home brew games. This is not something you can just go out to like your local video game store and pick up a cartridge for five, 10 bucks. It's, it's not gonna happen like that. So below, I'm gonna go ahead and put the links in, uh, to each game in the description, uh, basically giving you their download information for the ROMs. And most of the games, if not all of them, you should be able to purchase as well an actual cartridge. But if you've got one of these, or any kind of flash cart for the uh, ColecoVision, you can put your ROMs on that and play it. But if not, then you'll have to either do emulation or buy the actual cartridge. Now I'm also gonna post a link to a, uh, the Coleco emulator that I use um, down in the description as well. So, so if you wanted to try out any of these games, you can download that emulator and then go ahead and download the ROMs as well to you guys. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. You guys have a great one now. Peace out.